Welcome to the first of many video market reports for our Manhattan market. Let's start by dispelling some fears. The sky is not falling on the residential market. The third quarter, which starts in July, did see a sharp decline in the number of closings over $5 million, but this was largely expected. The new mansion tax rules took effect on July 1st, so many properties rushed to close by the end of the second quarter. Not surprisingly, that incentive to close resulted in an inflated all-time record number of closings for the month of June. Many of those closings were originally scheduled to take place in the third quarter. Now, the absence of these high price closings brought the average resale price down to its lowest levels in almost five years. But the median price, which is less affected by the high end sales, only declined by 5%. Now, all segments of the markets do continue to see some price adjustments, particularly in the plus $4 million market. But we're also seeing the selling price versus the original asking price now at 95%. New listings are requiring fewer price reductions as sellers begin listing properties closer to buyer expectations. Better pricing has resulted in more deals and a decrease in days on the market. Please feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions. I'm Steve Perino, The Handy Broker.